Our top story today, on his first full day in office, new U.S. President Joe Biden signed a flurry of orders to establish a national strategy for addressing the COVID-19 pandemic. He plans to issue several more within his first 10 days in the White House. Choi min starts us off. The newly elected U.S. President Joe Biden is set to issue dozens of executive orders in his first 10 days in office. According to an overview elaborated on by White House Chief of Staff Ron Klain, President Biden will take immediate action to, quote, move the country forward and undo Trump's legacy. The new administration's top priorities for the first days in office include the COVID-19 crisis, economic downturn, climate change, and racial injustice. Day one started off with the signing of at least 10 executive orders, memorandums, and directives aimed at tackling the COVID-19 pandemic. This comes after Biden issued the first round of executive orders on Inauguration Day. Speaking during his first full day in office, Biden unveiled strategies to contain the current health crisis by first promising to ramp up vaccination supplies. Our plan starts with mounting an aggressive, safe and effective vaccination campaign to meet our goal of administering 100 million shots in our first 100 days in office. We're on day one. This will be one of the greatest operational challenges our nation has ever undertaken. On top of Wednesday's mask mandate order on federal property, Biden added that facial coverings in airports and certain modes of transportation will also be required. The new order also requires foreigners to test negative for COVID-19 prior to arriving in the U.S. Biden also ordered improvements to the collection, production, analysis and sharing of the nation's COVID-19 data. He also sought to reopen schools under safe guidance. Additional executive orders will be issued in the upcoming days on matters related to relief funds, the Buy American policy, racial equity and climate crisis. Choi Min-jung, Arirang News.